guys welcome back to my channel um today i am going to be doing an updated fall routine wait what updated fall morning routine um i've never done a fall morning routine before i've only done um like my weekday morning routine it was like my first video ever but i am definitely like doing different things in the morning using different skincare drinking different coffee like doing all over different things so I thought I would share with you guys and I thought it would be really fun to just do a little updated fall version so for my skincare today I am going to be using my new regimen from Reddit and Fields called Recharge um it is I'll just read you guys what's on the front of the box because that's the best info info you're gonna get um so it says Recharge is a multitasking skincare system that acts like a nutrient-rich power super vitamin to balance and boost skin's defenses, visibly improving skin with the first use. First use. Each step is clinically tested, so they work together to defend against premature aging and repair skin's moisture barrier. Which is, hello, do you want to say hi? Say hi. What do you want? Do I go up here? Okay. There you go. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna open this bad boy up. I now there's cat hair on me. Um, I have literally I bought this at convention like a couple weeks ago, and I haven't used it yet because I've been saving it for this occasion. Um, so it comes, I mean I've opened it and like smelled it, but I haven't actually used it. So the first step, I'll set this here is a three-in-one super cleanser it looks like this it says the purpose um this melt this multitasking daily cleanser removes facial makeup that's cool um dirt and oil while gently exfoliating skin so i am going to quickly brush my hair and put my little skincare headband on and i will be right back <laughs>
I just did the first step. It feels really nice. Um, my skin, if I could describe it, feels clean. Like, <laughs> that sounds really vague, but like it feels like it really cleaned it. Like my face always feel, it feels like a little even tight, which I love in a cleanser. I really don't like when I use a cleanser and it doesn't make my skin feel like tighter and like more firm. Um, this definitely makes me feel like it's firming. Um, yeah, so far so good. Okay, the next step <clears throat> is this Ultra Boost Moisturizing Treatment. There's still cat hair on it from Lucy. Um, let's see what this says. A weightless gel cream that boosts antioxidant levels while restoring the skin's natural moisture barrier, which your girl needs in the winter or fall this time of year. Oh, okay. So Redden Fields normally doesn't have this cute little pump, but I love that. I'm going to peel this little sticky off here. Okay. I'm just going to shake it just to be sure oh okay it doesn't really have scent which i like okay i'm just gonna do two pumps just in case oh okay it's very light it almost feels just like water, but like it dries onto your skin instantly. Wow. Okay. I like that. Cool. Okay. Then the next step, the last step, and this step you only use in the mornings. Um, protect and Blur Broad Spectrum SPF 30 Sunscreen. So, um, the active ingredients are titanium dioxide and zinc oxide, in case anyone wanted to know. Um, it's 100% mineral UVA and UVB protection. Broad Spectrum SPF 30 protects skin while blurring the appearance of pores and fine lines. Wow. The oil-free formula virtually disappears into skin for a translucent, smooth, matte finish. I've also heard this this can be used as like a primer too, but um, make sure that you guys are still putting on SPF, even in the winter and the fall, um, because the sun is still there. It doesn't go away. Even though it feels like it goes away, it's still there. This one also has the cute little pump. Um, okay. Here we go. Ooh. Okay, so it's like a pinky. I'll show you guys. It's like a pink color. And it's very, it looks matte. Like it looks, it doesn't look very shiny. So I'm just going to like dot this on my face. Oh my God, it smells amazing. I could smell that all day. I want this in like an air freshener scent. <laughs> okay. Get the rest of the stuff off. Okay. And then you guys know I always put the leftover sunscreen on top of my hands. Because your hand, your hand. Can I speak? Your hands show the first signs of aging. And most people forget to put SPF on their hands. So put SPF on your hands. Okay. Rub this in. Mm. Okay, I can definitely see it blurring immediately. Immediately. Wow. I really, really like that actually. Hello, you're back. Hi. What can I help you with? You wanna say hi again? She's back. What do you want, darling? What do you want? <laughs> what? Maybe she likes the smell. 
Hi. You trying to look outside? I love her. Yeah, for this is Lucy, by the way, for those of you who maybe are new to my life. Um, she's my little calico baby. Can you even see me? Hello. Um, she's my little calico baby um, that I adopted almost a year ago. So next thing I'm going to do, so that was my skincare routine. Um, I've never done that before. That's the only three steps I'm going to use this. Ah, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I lied to you guys. I need to put my eye cream on. So this is active, still have cat hair, active hydration, bright eye complex. This is for dark circles, puffy eyes, um, bags, whatever. Um, this is, an, this is a little anti-aging, but we have a specific, um, eye cream for anti-aging in Rodan and Field. So you can use both if you wish, but I just use this one for now. And you, you guys know I have crazy bags. I've talked about it before under my eyes. So this really helps me. And I'm just gonna put the eye cream under my eyes like this. I'm just gonna dab it. If you sit and pull like this, that could create wrinkles over time. So don't do that. Um, just dab it. Now I am all done officially um, with my skincare, but Next thing I'm going to do is brush my teeth. I'll show you guys, I guess, what I do for that. Um, this is my toothbrush. It's just a Oral-B plain toothbrush. I've used many toothbrushes over time. I've used Sonic Care, like the really nice um, electric toothbrushes. I've just used like average electric toothbrushes. Um, I've used super cheap normal toothbrushes that aren't electric. So far, this is probably my favorite. So Oral-B, um, it does not have the little tongue scraper on the back, sadly, which I really, really wish it had that. Um, but I love the bristles on this one and um, I love the color. But if anyone, I really do want to get like a um, waste-free toothbrush. So if you guys know of a good one that works, please let me know. I, I really have to take good care of my teeth. Um, I've always had like teeth problems in the past. So taking care of my teeth is really, really important to me. So if it doesn't work that well, I will not buy it. Um, so if you guys know of a waste free, really good toothbrush, please let me know because I need to know of one of those. Um, but this is my toothbrush. And then the toothpaste that I use is Crest 3D White Lux. I'm um, in glamorous white. So I'm just gonna wet my brush and then a little bit on there and then wet it again because if you don't do that, I don't know if I can be friends with you. Just kidding. Um, and then here we go. teeth are all brushed um that is so important um for me to like I said have a really really good um, teeth routine because I've always had really bad like problems with cavities um, I had braces for a really long time um it's just like a really big problem for me and I know I'm not alone on this so um just know like I used to be really embarrassed about talking about teeth but like we all have teeth. We've all like struggled with our teeth before and um, yeah. So teeth are probably like one of my in biggest insecurities. That's why I try really, really hard to take care of them um, the best I can. So the next step is I'm going to floss and I floss every single day and I'm not even lying. <laughs> um, so this is the little flosser pick that I use. I'm not totally sure what brand this is or like what kind. But 
basically you can squeeze this to make the little string tighter or if you leave it it's like a little bit looser so i'm gonna go ahead and floss and then i will show you guys my next step <laughs> Right, guys i'm done flossing i'm just gonna go ahead and throw this away and then next i'm going to use another little floss pick for underneath my retainer that is permanently glued in um, behind my bottom teeth i'm sure many of you guys have the same thing either on the top or the bottom or both um but i use these hold on one second these little picks um the brand is gum and they are the for like the it has like bigger spaces in between your teeth um some of my teeth have more spaces than others i'm probably gonna have to get like invisalign or something again um uh, because my teeth are just like shifting weird right now um but i use these just so i make sure i really get a good clean because they are a little bit wider so they cover more of the area so i'm gonna go ahead and do that all right guys i'm gonna throw this away And that is it for my teeth for the morning. Um, at night, I do use um, some mouthwash um, after I do my flossing, but um, for the morning, I don't use mouthwash. I only use it at night. Um, so next, we are going to go make some coffee. coffee is made um every morning i have coffee usually um in the mornings that i work we have it preset um to brew at a certain time every morning um but on the weekends i never know when i'm going to be waking up so i just do it whenever i wake up um and brady works on saturdays so he usually um will either make his own coffee or he just won't have any um in the morning before he goes to work on saturday bless his soul i couldn't do that <laughs> um but now i am just going to oh my gosh it's so bright <laughs> um now i'm just going to read for a little bit um on the weekends i really try to like reset myself do the most ideal routines that i can do because during the week it gets a little hectic for me um i fall 
in and out of routines a lot. I don't really have a lot of really super set routines during my week. Um, so during the weekends, I really like to do the most ideal routine for myself. So right now I am reading Girl, Wash Your Face by Rachel Hollis. Um, I am almost halfway through. I have never read it before. Um, so far, I really, really like it. Um, and I actually saw her speak at Rodan and Fields convention this year and she was amazing and now I'm like obsessed with her. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, she's a super, super motivating speaker, um, super motivating writer. If you guys don't already follow her or like listen to her podcast or anything, I would definitely suggest that. Hello, Charlie. Um, she's awesome. I will continue to read her books. I know that she has another book um, and I will read that one probably next. I think it's called Girl Stop Apologizing, I think. Um, so I'm just going to read for a little bit and drink my coffee and just enjoy my morning for a little bit. so I just finished my coffee and now I am going to get ready for the day um my hair is looking a little greasy right now um so I'm going to pop some dry shampoo in my hair and maybe put a little makeup on and just start to get ready for the day um pick out an outfit and yeah I am finished with my makeup and I am not sure what I'm going to do with my hair yet today um, but I did put the dry shampoo in I brushed it and um, like I could go out in public like this so I'm just gonna leave it for now um, now I need to pick out an outfit so I will pick out an outfit for you guys
that is it for my morning routine. Um, I am all ready for the day now, so I am going to go ahead and get started on what I need to get done today. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys would be so kind and subscribe, like the video, turn on notifications. Um, that would obviously mean the world to me. And I do have Instagram. Um, it's just Katerina Joy Dicker. I will pop it in at the end for you guys to see if you'd like to go ahead and follow me on there. I post way more on Instagram than I do on YouTube. So feel free to follow me and I will see you guys next time. Thank you guys. Bye.